And now let us pray for ourselves and for our world. God of all people, your love and grace sustains the world and all who live in it. When we foolishly set up walls between people, you tear them down and draw us into one family, united in Christ and in compassion. The pandemic has filled so many nations and neighbors with turmoil and fear. So we come before you with prayers for the world you love. Astonishing God, you surprise us. You come to us in unforeseen circumstances and in unexpected people. We give you thanks for all the healers and heroes who have stepped forward during this pandemic to surprise us with kindness and courage. We pray for all who still face upheaval and uncertainty because of COVID-19. Call out leaders with wisdom and imagination to address the fear and the change we are facing and fill our hearts with compassion and understanding for those most fearful. God of peace, you reassure us. You remind us not to be afraid when troubles arise. We pray for all people who live in precarious situations not related to the pandemic. Assure them that they are not forgotten. We pray for those who struggle with illness, grief, or depression. May they know your peace and strength. Help us to reach out in every way we can to embody your love in our words and our actions. God of hope, you challenge us you come to us in the midst of trouble and invite us to stand for justice and work for truth. We pray for all of those people crying out for fair treatment, working against racism and discrimination, who are telling painful stories of their lives. Open our hearts with understanding and motivate us to act for change. We pray for those who resist the stories of injustice and defend inequality. Open their minds to the truths they deny and show them new possibilities for relationships that bridge divides. Send your spirit to work in our communities to create mutual respect and new ways to live as neighbors. God of safety, you save us. You come to us when living becomes hard and when we are consumed by fear. We pray for the safety of all people. We especially pray for the people of Beirut and Lebanon after the huge explosion this week. We pray for those who are grieving, those who are injured, all who face hunger and the rebuilding of their shattered lives. May all corners of the globe know justice and peace and each person find a place to call home. O oh Lord, we place our trust in you and ask you the, to answer these prayers and all those we bring before you. Hear us now as we pray with all your people, as you taught us, saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our closing hymn, 326, Give to the winds thy fears. <laughs> 